Alexis, these past years we have had some challenges, some obstacles. I see those obstacles as the building blocks to our relationship. You truly complete me and make me want to be the best version of myself. I promise that I will always be there for you. I will care for you through sickness and good health, and I will always be your shoulder to lean on. You are smart, you are funny, and you are full of life. You are the hardest worker in the room, and I finally found someone that loves me for me, and I promise to do the same. Alexis, you are my soulmate, and I will love you until I take my last breath. You are truly my best friend. Forever, DJ. Dear DJ, today's the day. We made it. I feel like the luckiest woman in the world. I finally get to marry my soulmate. It is clear to me now that everything in my life has led me to you. I think back to all of my choices and even consider my bad ones. Blessed because if I had done even one thing differently, I might have never met you and become your wife. We have lived in three apartments, a hotel, in two states so far, but I know this is just the beginning of our journey together. Our life is going to be filled with adventures and I am so thankful that you are the one by my side for all of them. I have no doubt that any obstacle we face, will, we will conquer it. When I think of our future, I see us as happy family and know you will be the best father to our future children or for babies. From this day forward, I promise the following things. I will laugh with you in times of joy and comfort, and comfort you in times of sorrow. I will share your dreams and support you as you strive to achieve your goals and dreams. I will listen to you with uh, compassion and understanding and speak to you with encouragement. Oh, and I vow to still grab your butt even when we're old and wrinkly. I will remain faithful to our, our vows for better or for worse in times of sickness and in health. You are my absolute best friend, and I will love and respect you always. I love you, DJ, forever and always. See you soon, forever, your wife. Lex.
Welcome everybody. We are gathered here today to witness, honor, and celebrate the joining of Alexis and DJ through marriage. Alexis is making this covenant because you make her bad days better. You make her better days great and her great days incredible. She sees that you look for the positive in all scenarios and you can always put a smile on her face regardless of the situation. She knows that the two of you are happy just sitting in the same room, just being together. You have no need for constant distractions, but when adventure arises, you enjoy them together. Alexis, DJ is making this covenant with you because he sees the love that you have to give not only him, but to others. He sees that you are selfless and that you are always putting others before yourself. You make DJ want to be the, the best that he can be. You make him want to be the best version of himself. You are both making this covenant because you love each other in a way that makes it hard to describe with words. You love each other so much that the only thing you can do to express that love to one another is through marriage. DJ, will you take Alexis to be your wife, to have and to hold from this day forward for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish? Will you love her unconditionally and be all that you can be for her even when she is not? Will you devote your love to her daily and only be separated from her by death? I will. Alexis, will you take DJ to be your husband, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish? Will you love him unconditionally and be all that you can be for him even when he is not? Will you devote your love to him daily and only be separated from him by death? Well. I now pronounce you husband and wife. DJ, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I now introduce you to Mr. and Mrs. DJ and Alexis McCarthy. My name is Brian, and I'm the best man. Uh, thank you for coming out. I wanted to get that out of the way. When DJ asked me to be his best man, I felt extremely honored because I know how many great guys he has in his circle, and um, I was just happy to be a part of it. So uh, for him to ask me to be the best man, it, uh, it meant a lot. DJ is a great person. Um, 
a lot of what he does and what he says is based on morals. Um, I know that we've talked about that a bunch. Uh, morals mean a lot to DJ. Um, and one of the things that really stood out to me at the I Do Barbecue um, in preparation for this event tonight was his mom kept asking, I raised a great kid, didn't I? I raised a great kid, didn't I? And I just wanted to say, yes, everyone here knows that you raised a great kid. Hi, everybody. My name is Audrey. Um, I know a lot of you. It's been probably over 10 years, probably, but that's, um, we've known each other much longer than that, actually. The circumstances of us meeting is uh, kind of an interesting one. Both of us went to two different schools um, in middle school, and it's amazing hearing um, Brian's speech. It's, it's just kind of very similar to mine, and I, it seems like you really are like the same person. <laughs> but um, we actually earned MVP trophies um, in middle school. And I would call this a twist of fate, but I don't really believe in coincidences. But our trophies got switched, and that's how we met in the very first place. We had to switch them back. Um, <laughs> and I was bummed about that. Oh, man, I had to, we, okay. But, Yep, she stole my trophy, yep. Um, but in our tiny little town um, where people live, I mean, 30 minutes, 40 minutes apart, we realized that we live maybe less than two miles down the road from each other. And from that point on, I mean, in high school, we just became fast friends and then best friends. Um, our friendship has really gone the distance, I would say. I mean, we've been up to 3,000 miles apart um, and she would come visit and we would find a way to make it work, FaceTime, talking. I think any time um, I heard her voice, I, it felt like home and she's always been family to me and will always be family to me. Um, but Alexis is a fierce competitor. She's a fierce lover. She loves people and if she loves you, she's your friend, she's your family. I mean, she will do absolutely anything for the people that she loves. And DJ, you are in luck, my friend. She is, she is a gem. You're the wind in my sails. You're the pull of the sea. You're the wish in the well. You're my faithful belief. If the whole wide world was offered to me, Still you'd be all I need You're the first of the year A warm kiss in the cold You're the whisper in my ear When I need it the most If I was cast on an island And could only bring one thing Still you'd be all I need All I need No words to speak Just know you're all I need So when you're feeling blue With a weight on your chest I can feel it too I'll take your worst and the best I'll be there for you like you're there for me Cause you are all I need All I need I need How do I say How much you really mean When I can't find no way Oh, 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 oh,
You're the pole of the sea You're the wish in the well And my faithful belief If the whole wide world Was offered to me Still you'd be all I need Oh, you'd be all I need